Alright, the first step in building a template is to draw a perpendicular line. So we're going to start by drawing uh, with the base of the triangle. Just make a straight line on any piece of cardboard that's at least 24 inches long. And I'll start here and extend my line all the way. Now, once I've got that, I take my T-square and place it so that my perpendicular, perpendicular line is right in the middle. very important that this line be perpendicular because all the other measurements are going to be relative to these two lines. Okay, now that looks like a good start. So the next thing we want to do is measure the points from uh, the center if you look here I've got an example of what we're doing and it shows um, that the distance from the center here to the base of this triangle is 4.6875 inches. The, you have to convert this 0.6875 inches to sixteenths because our tape measure has 16 lines for every inch. So in parentheses, I have 11, which is the equivalent in inches of 11 sixteenths, actually, so that we can do this calculation. Let me show you what I mean. So I'm going to go put my ruler so that I'm right in the center here, and it doesn't matter where, right now I've got this line between on the 7 here, right in the middle, and I'm going to measure out 4 inches, which is 1, 2, 3, 4 inches, and now I need to go 11 sixteenths. And so I start counting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. My line is right there. So I make a little mark there. And I do the same thing going in the opposite direction. 1 inch, 2, 3, 4. Then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, right there. And the distance between the two of these guys should be 9.375, which we don't really need to worry about at this point. <clears throat> so the next measurement is to come out from the base of the triangle to this point, which is 11.85. And the 0.85 is converted to 13.6 sixteenths. Okay, so let's come out. There's 11, and now we'll go 
13, so there's 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and point 6 is a little bit more than halfway, so it's right about there. next mark. So what we're going to do with that is we're going to draw another perpendicular line. And this time we're going to go to the side. Okay, so the distance we need to come out from this center, as you can see here, is 3.375. And that convert, that point 0.375 converts to 6 sixteenths. So, we'll put a Right here on the middle here, it doesn't matter where we start, and I'll go one, two, three inches, and then six sixteenths. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right there. And do the same thing in this direction. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six sixteenths. Okay, and now we just continue down <coughs> to the next point. <coughs> 